Once upon a time, in a kingdom far, far away, there was a noble woman named Lady Gertrude. She was a jolly woman who loved to eat and drink. She was also a big woman, so big that she could not fit on any of the horses in her local stables. Lady Gertrude had always dreamed of becoming a knight. She admired the bravery and courage of the knights who rode into battle and fought for their kingdom. She longed to be a part of that world, but she knew that she needed a horse to do so. One day, Lady Gertrude decided to go on a quest to find a horse that she could ride. She set out on her journey, riding on the back of a cow. The cow was slow and not very sturdy, so Lady Gertrude fell off several times. She continued on her quest, riding on the back of a pig, a sheep, and even a donkey. Each animal she rode on was not strong enough to carry her weight, and she fell off each one. Lady Gertrude was getting discouraged. She had been traveling for days and had not found a suitable horse. She was about to give up when she stumbled upon a dragon. The dragon was enormous, and Lady Gertrude was hesitant to approach it. But she knew that this might be her last chance to find a horse, so she gathered up all her courage and climbed onto the dragon's back. To her surprise, the dragon didn't mind at all. In fact, it seemed to enjoy having Lady Gertrude on its back. It flew high into the sky, and Lady Gertrude felt like she was flying. When they landed, Lady Gertrude knew that she had found her horse. She named the dragon Sir Firebreath and rode it proudly into battle. Lady Gertrude became one of the bravest knights in the kingdom, and she and Sir Firebreath became a legendary duo. From that day on, Lady Gertrude knew that anything was possible if she had the courage to try. She may have been too big for a regular horse, but she had found a dragon that was perfect for her. And she had become the knight she had always dreamed of being.